Hi there, my name is Nadia and I'm today going to be answering some of your frequently asked questions in relation to the Mako for Maya bra. So you buy according to your normal high street bra size. We don't need to know the letter, so A, B, C, D is irrelevant. We just need to know, know your numerical high street bra sizing, so 32, 34, 36, 38, and so forth. Um, so you buy according to normal high street bra size, and if it fits before surgery, it will fit after the surgery because the cups itself will mold and expand to whatever size you're going to be after your procedure. So mucking garments are designed to last. We do recommend hand washing the garments. The garments do not come with an expiry date, so if you do look after them, they can and will last years. No, you don't need to get a special sleeping bra. We do make them, but you could easily just use the same bra you wore immediately after surgery and wear it for many years, also for sleeping. If you're using the machine, it needs to be on a hand wash setting in your machine. And I would always put it inside a mesh bag. So this is not something that we, we sell or you're provided with, but you can easily find these online. Um, and you pop your garment inside there and that's preventing stressing the fibers in the garment. And never apply heat to a garment and don't tumble dry them. And if you follow those washing instructions, your garment should last many, many years to come. So in the very unlikely event that the bra is a bit tight after the procedure, the very easy thing to remedy that is to just fasten the hook and eyes on the second row, so the looser setting as opposed to the tighter one, where ideally you should be. But it happens, sometimes you know we have a little bit of unexpected swelling and you feel a bit tight across the chest, so just loosen it. We specialize in medical grade edge compression garments and bras. So these will help to optimize the healing journey, but also reduce the risks. So it will improve blood microcirculation, break down fluid within the body, so it improves lymphatic drainage, but all the while make it also more comfortable for the patient. So it's medical graded compression, which usually you won't find in sort of high streets or online um, cheaper brands. So the muck and bra should never rub against any scars or delicate incisions because it's without seams on the chest. So as you can see, it's completely seamless here. So where you have usually your, or your scar, whether it's a breast augmentation, the scar would be here, if you had a mastopex, it would be around here, and a breast reduction, it would go um, along the inframammary fold and up to the areola. But there's no seams to be rubbing against it. So for hygienic purposes, really, um, you wear one, you wash the other, and then you rotate around that way. So, as a rule of thumb, I think it's sensible to sleep in the bra for at least six weeks. Usually around about that point is when you go back for your second checkup within the clinic. So I would wait six weeks before taking off the bra at night time. So your Mako for Maya bra is only available through your Maya clinic. So you would call your patient uh, administrator and they can help you to purchase your Macon for Maya brother.